Starting off at Annapolis District Court, a movement of dozens putting feet to the pavement, marching through the streets with eyes set on the state house. So who are we? We the Maryland Coalition for Police Accountability and Justice. As its members gathered on Lawyers Mall under the statue of former Supreme Court Justice Thurgood Marshall. Protest is the language of those who are marginalized. Protest is the language of those who are not considered the gentry, those who are not considered the privileged. This is what we have to do. Their efforts come two days. Maryland Police Accountability Act of 2021. After a heated debate on the Senate floor. We're talking about a violation of public trust. Policing is a public function. And it is unlike any other profession because decisions that are made are often final. There is no appeal from death. The officer's children in school are likely to be harassed and bullied because of the false complaint made against their father. This bill would permit that. Ended with a package of police reform bills passed, but with some amendments voted down, and because of that, demonstrators say the measures don't go far enough. The group with five demands to lawmakers repeal the law enforcement officer's Bill of Rights, give control of the Baltimore Police Department to its residents, make investigations into police misconduct transparent, limit the use of force by law enforcement, and remove officers from schools. And we got to stay in the streets continuously until we get justice, the five demands. And while there are several police reform bills still to be discussed in the coming days, demonstrators say they will continue to rally until their demands are met. In Annapolis, I'm Trey Ward, WBAL-TV, 11 News.